much. Yeah. Right, so what do you want to do? Okay, great. Well, I'm going to say a few words and then have a little position and you can say a few words. Okay, so thank you all for showing out today. Uh, thank you to the Sadness that came out, it's all about you and your safety and your city. Thank you to the London Zone and thank you to Mr Gillian. Um, we were all very shocked and scared uh, a month ago when six of our fellow cyclists died. We were killed on our roads over a very short period of time, two weeks. And we needed to respond, we wanted to respond, and we have responded. 36,804 of us at the last count have responded, asking the powers that be at City Hall to rapidly accelerate their plan for cycling infrastructure in the city and to produce a plan of, of what cyclists can expect to see over the next 12 months. So, uh, Mr. Gilligan, here we are. Thank you very much. voices. <laughs> just to this camera, just. And to, and to me, Andrew, please. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is your Christmas present, come on. Thank you. <laughs> Normal cyclists. I, I, I'm told it's just a CD in here, is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Score names. Okay, that's good. That's so, that's so digital. Um, thank you very much for this. Uh, I think the demands you make in the push there is highly reasonable. Uh, went some way, I hope, yesterday towards setting up the timetable. Um, we will be uh, in a position to say more about that timetable today in the session of the Assembly and more about it in the days and weeks and as well. Um, I think we more or less agree with what's wanted. Um, the only dispute between us is about timing. Um, and, uh, here today, you'll be explaining to some, some of the reasons why this kind of thing can't happen overnight. It's the biggest change to uh, the London's road network for about 30 years. Um, but we'll be able to explain some of the things we're doing. So thank you very much indeed for this petition and um, thank you all for your concern for uh, Cyclist Safety London. Andrew, what's more to this then, Andrew?